Hi again, man and we're here again. If you didn't watch my last episode with this pilot, with the eye look I have right here on top, love this pilot. Definitely a good buy. It's fourteen dollars. I will have a link to this pilot. Um, if you don't know who I am, as you're new here, um, I mean YouTuber that reviews makeup. I'm not claiming to be a makeup artist. But it could be someday. I do have a, <sighs> sorry, a background in art. So, and also have, I'm a published writer. I have two books, a link to those books in the description box. If you really like my video, you can find links to a coffee tip that you can just give me a tip. Say, hey, I like your video. There you go, $3 tip. And also on um, Patriarch as well. You can find links to that in the description box and all of the products, well, products that I'm reviewing. Uh, I will put a link to this. But anyway, how I created this look, I will say by this. I went a little bit wild with the black eye. I just, what the hell? So what? Um, I used... This is my lashes by Leverion New York. I use Oprah highlight. Pretty good highlight, even though the packaging's kind of cheap, but oh well. It works really well. Um and I used Elf Corrector to go in my problem areas. I'm working on getting a corrector that works better. Because I want to go to just using a powder. Because I only got a few problem areas. So, why use foundation, whole thing of foundation if you don't need to? So, we do know any good, really good correctors. I have combination skin. Maybe you do. Maybe you have something that works great. Please put it in the comments. Because I would love to try it. I use the black here from this pilot. This black here. And I do have um, red underneath. I have this shade and this shade. And I have two different eye looks for this pilot. Um, I hope you haven't clicked on my <laughs> clicked off my video because people are kind of click happy. It's like, oh my god, fly. But anyway, they're kind of click happy. I'm gonna get to the point. Why? You clicked on this video, but I want to go through what I used so far. So, please be patient. Uh, LA Colors, this is the bronzer, this is a, a, a powder. And I also used Wet n Wild Full Cover Powder as well. So, thank you for, for being so patient if you were being actually patient. <laughs> <laughs> didn't already click off this video but anyway um let's get to why you clicked on this video if i can find it okay i have tried them a little bit off camera where do they put them I will find them. I need a better organizing thing than I have. I've seen smaller ones, those plastic drawers, smaller ones. And I need to get some of those. It sorts out things. Any minute now. I will find them. I'm gonna put them back in the bag. This is the Ulta bag. First time going to Ulta. I'm gonna pause this video for a little bit and find them. I found them. Find a little package. I got the mini size. 
because they were so cute. I had a um, makeup kit in my hand for like 12 something. But then I saw these and I saw how cute they were. So I must wash them somewhere. <laughs> okay. They're very cute and they're very good quality for $12. Kind of a brownish pink. And this one is, I believe, is Candy K. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a lot of uses out of this. Out of these. I'm very sure. Because they're, they're usually the shades. That, well, not this one. But this one. I'll play this one a little bit. What the fuck? Fly. I thought flies are supposed to die in 24 hours. Apparently not. Okay, I'm going to put this on first. And this is... Charm. I like how small the wand is. Because I have tiny lips. And it's gonna wipe it off. <laughs> and then put it on the other one. I wish I looked on Ulta website. All they have is these two shades. I wish you put out more mini size shades. So I actually do like them. You have a good smell to them too, and they kind of taste good. <laughs> but no, I don't. I'm pretty sure they're not edible. So these, I don't. If you like mutual shades as I do, I like pinks, especially peach. Like pinks. I'll show you how many I own here. Okay. I own these tinted bombs for Wet and Wild, Anastasia. Pink, Elf, Wet n Wild. I own quite a few. Uh, I like red sometimes. That's why Dollar Tree, a brand of Dollar Tree, which is very similar to the shade. Right here. I think it's a cross. Cross shade. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's like a cross shade between these two. So that's cool. This I got from Dollar Tree. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. But I would like her to come out with more of these. More shades. Because... I'm a small lip girl, and I really like these. So, I'm gonna put these back in these little packages. They're so cute. I know it just came out for the holidays, but I wish she had more. And um, I didn't never looked at her stuff before until I saw it in Alta. It was the first time I was in Alta. I live in a little small town in Virginia. Um, and I saw how cute they were, like, and I saw, and then I saw our other items and stuff. I was like, I want that, I want that, I want that, I want that, I want that. I wanted it all. And I saw, um, KKW Beauty, yes, Beauty, um, too. And I was like, I was looking, it's better, it's different when you see them in person than when you see them online. You know, obviously. Um, and I was like looking at it. I'm like, I want that. So I think I'll be definitely picking up the WWK Beauty when it's for pilots. Because I really like it. Even though it's not great packaging. Get out of my family area. But anyway. 
even though it's not great packaging, it's really about the product, right? So I really want to pick that up. Hope this wasn't too like crazy, but oh well. I just went with it and had fun. Makeup is to have fun with. So I think it's porcelain. Her show is named Porcelain. She says it's just makeup. It's not that serious. No, it's not. It's to have fun with and to enjoy. But anyway, this is yeah, a little bit crazy. But oh well. I still pulled it off nicely. <laughs> but anyway, thank you so much for watching me. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope you like and subscribe and comment. Or dislike. Keep the trolling to a minimal, okay? I know life is stressful, especially now in America. But there's no excuse to troll people, okay? Let's just be nice. You can still get across... You can get useful criticism to help someone. They can take it or leave it. But when we actually be mean-spirited and stuff, mm, that's just bad for you. That's bad for your soul. It doesn't really reflect on me too much. Just make tells me what kind of person <laughs> you are. And you must be going through it if you're doing that, acting out in that way. But anyway, much love and many blessings to you. I hope you do great in life too. I hope to grow my YouTube channel and get better at it. I have gotten better at it so far. You can see the res. But I have gotten better at it so far and I continue to get better at it. So practice makes perfect, don't it? But anyway, much love to you. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe. Please. And watch me. I want to be your new session. But anyway. Bye. <laughs>